Wow. Uh, um. All right. Hey, man. That was so incredibly rad. I wish. Uh, I wish we <laughs> ever practiced ever. What's yeah. that? I wish we ever practiced. I mean, show. we're like punk rock in that we suck. Well, no. Well, yeah. No, that's true. That's true. Hold on. You know, what else is very punk rock. Oh, wait a second. That was good. <laughs> What's up, Jay? Jay Balls. <laughs> What's up, motherfucker? Oh no, Jay, we're stuck. <laughs> Damn it. Still on it. Had to be careful. I give you no points. And may God have mercy on your soul. You lose. You lose. So we agree. We agree that that like that's the official winner of the belt, right? Here we go. Special guest. Jay was the secret guest all along. I am just a <laughs> fake. It was Jay Brush. Fooled you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Patrick has a great idea. What if we had an episode where my brother and your brother hosted it, and they just did like we, you and I could just switch and watch from the sides. Oh my God! If if we ever did a four episode. quadrant brother episode, uh, it it might be the loosest, most ridiculous episode ever. Oh my God! <laughs> See, Miller thirteen says I'm actually crying. I'll tell you what I think. A podcast with my brother and your brother actually might be really, 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 really funny. Uh, yeah, man. I think we both have ex extraordinarily funny brothers. Holy! Guys, that's God. an April Fool's episode waiting to happen. You just never say anything about it. <laughs> Jeez, I'm glad, but it just, I'm sad I just brought it up. Uh, all right, so it what are we calling this a ski cheat moment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can't. It's That's too good of a line. It's so early, though. Yeah, all right, that's fine. I'm fine with that. Home uh, it up. Homeowner? <laughs> Sex to all things? <laughs> Ask the devil? Although it would really be funny if it was just... Pizza! <laughs> no, oh, it has to be pizza. Oh, but no, it can't be. That's because the first line, though. I know, but all right. <clears throat> I guess. Ask old Scrote. <laughs> <laughs> I, I kind of like sex doll things. That one's pretty good. It's got to be pizza. The problem is that thing's going to blow up. That pizza video is going to blow up. So why should we not have it as the name of our show? All right. All right. No, that's fair enough. That's a really good point. <clears throat> How many A's? Uh, I'm gonna oh. go with 18. Oh, here, actually, this is this is the actual number here, for Tony. Tony, stop doing this. <laughs> <laughs> and that's that's copied exactly from the actual video, which dropped over a year ago, almost a year really? ago. No, 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 December 8th, this past December 8th. How many was it up to? It's only at 92,000. Fart in my mouth. No, I will not do that no. at all, sir. That, all right. No. I was just asking. <laughs> Pizza! Well, maybe when you move. Sorry. Okay. So this is, is called pizza. I'll, I'll just call call it pizza. No, you have to do the thing. Mm -mm. Why not? Because it'll be funnier. Because uh, you know, because then we're not obviously. Oh, okay. I got you. Right. Yeah. <clears throat> so that means we'll also pizza. Maybe we'll do this many A's and then a period. All right. And then maybe a tilde. Yes. Uh, and a tilde one. And no calzones. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Brilliant. A D. Uh, D. No, a D instead of the four. <laughs> there we go. Right. Sharpen it up. <clears throat> Sharpen it up. 
Come on, ladies. <laughs> Bust out that skeet sheet. <laughs> okay, here we go. <clears throat> this is NSFW episode. I don't know which number. Uh, go ahead and play it. Oh, no. Double complete rainbow. Oh, man. Somebody tell me what episode number are we at? 127. All right. This is NSFW episode 127, recorded on May 15th, 2012. Pizza. Is somebody all right? Pete Henny's saying it's the real commercial. Like, is he putting that up there? Like, do people really not know that commercial? Because all I definitely feel like I'm a billion years old. Well, if you don't know it, uh, that's a problem. Pizza in the morning. Pizza. Oh no, 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 of course, of course, it's the real, the real. So no, I know, but it, it would really make me feel old if everyone's like, "Hey, what a crazy commercial that is!" Oh no. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, all right. So I do the thing. Here we go. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the newest edition of NSFW. Who do we have as our special guest? You don't know. I don't know. But you'll find out in a few minutes. It's full of terrifying surprises. We're gonna put that guest through their paces like a real broadcaster and throw some silly stories at him. See if he can make sense of them. Then he's gonna give some life advice. This would all make a lot more sense if you knew who it was. But you're not gonna know until a few seconds from now. But wait, right when you're about to turn off the episode and say this is boring and you guys have no talent. Hold on, Buster Brown, because you're going to have a chance to win a lot of fun prizes in a new contest we invent. It's all coming up on this episode of NSFW Show. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right. So there's that. Mm. That's what oh, my mic is cut. All right, go for it. You you want to do the just sponsor? You got a sponsor? Oh, fart in five <laughs> animals' faces. Oh my gosh, there's a spider on the table. Well. <laughs> kill it, kill it, Darren, kill it. <laughs> oh, it never gets old. It never gets old. <laughs> I want to point out also that I had one job, and that was to find a bit of Tom Merritt <clears throat> tossing to Ayaz so that we could throw to Tom Merritt who would toss to Ayaz. And after like 20 minutes of searching, I'm like, I don't know how to find this. Let me recruit Cheeto. So I hit up Cheeto, and Cheeto's like, man, I can't find him. I'm like, dude, start asking other chat rooms. So Cheeto and T2T2 uh, and, and I think uh, Blender MF as well started going crazy uh, looking for it. And they found the spider thing. That was pretty easy because they they had seen it before. But there does not exist in all of TNT any moment of of Tom tossing to you. I as it's just you always assume the sale. And, it happened today. Uh, but it's a good idea, don't you think? It's it's happened. Uh, is my mic up? Because I can't hear anything. No, yeah, I can. We can hear you. You sound great. Oh anyway, yeah. So what I was saying was. It's happened like in the past couple episodes where Tom will throw it to me. And be like that's not the case, is it? I is, and I will say, yeah, that's the way it is, and blah blah blah. So there, there, there are instances of this, and especially this year, a whole lot of them this year. So you folks are freaking lazy. Wow, wow. There's big a great shots. There's big a, shots taken. There's there's a yeah. great list of things I would call the fine folks of Chat Realm. Uh, lazy. And to be fair, we gave them a grand total of what thirty minutes to find this. It was oh, 40 well, they should have, they 40, should have looked 40 the latest minutes. episode. Though, yeah, guys. yeah. Uh, all right, oh, here we go. You ready? I love them. I love the wow. chat room. I want to have all of their a sudden babies. they found they found Christianity really fast. Now they're like f the devil. <laughs> <laughs> Shout at the devil. <laughs> All right, here we go. This episode of NSFW Show is brought to you by Squarespace.com, a fast and easy way to create a high-quality website or blog. For a free trial and 10% off your first purchase on new accounts, go to Squarespace.com and use offer code NSFW5. And now you can get a free domain registration with an annual plan subscription. If you only have one then that would be where it would end. But we don't only have one. We have another read for Netflix. 
And Brian, I believe what I say in between two reads is... Watch thousands of television episodes and movies on your PC, Mac, iPad, iPhone, or TV instantly. All streamed directly to you, saving you time, money, and hassle. For your free 30-day trial, go to Netflix.com slash twit. Woo! Jimmy Cox! <laughs> That's Jimmy's cousin. <laughs> Is his hayseed cousin? Yeah, his hayseed cousin, uh... Johnny Nuts. <laughs> Johnny Nuts. <laughs> hey, y'all, it's me. Johnny. Ooh, Johnny Nuts. <laughs> my cousin, my cousin Jimmy's the fastest whore in all of Mexico. <laughs> Ooh, Jimmy Cuts. <laughs> Johnny Nuts. But you see, Johnny my Nuts, name's ironically. Johnny Nuts. <clears throat> Johnny Nuts is totally straight, and he just, but he changed his name legally when he opened his pecan farm, where they have salted pecans, they have raspberry dipped pecans. We've got, and it's, it's, yeah. To be honest, we're all a little ashamed of our cousin Jimmy's lifestyle. <laughs> <laughs> Here in the Nuts family, we only like to do two things. Salt nuts, <laughs> roast nuts, put them in our mouths. <laughs> and he gets offended every time hey, somebody starts giggling. Johnny Nuts is what they say when they eat my nuts. Okay. Because they just had the best nuts right they've now. ever had in their life. All right. <clears throat> uh, all right. All right, man. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and wrap things <laughs> no, up. No, another Brian. It says there's not Jenny Vagina. <laughs> <laughs> now, however, he does have a cousin who runs a taco stand. Yes. Oops. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Carla, I can't say her last name. <laughs> Did you hear Tom Merritt make a, uh, make a, this morning on frame rate? Um, <clears throat> where we were talking, I was like, man, you're like a freaking wizard. I'm like, where's your crystal ball? And he's, and he leads back and he goes, I have, and he goes, or he goes, actually, I have, and then he stops. And then I completed the joke in my mind, and then I, <laughs> I burst out laughing. <laughs> do, you, do you not get it? Like he has two crystal balls? Yes, exactly. He's going to leave back and say, where's your crystal ball? He's like, actually, I have. And then he cut himself off right there and then yeah. you know, realized that it was 10 in the morning. And then you just spend the rest of the episode going, look at him. <laughs> look at him. Let's show you your future. <laughs> They're magic. <laughs> You ever seen your future, boy? You want to see it? I got twin visions for you. That's what they call me. All right, I'm going to save Two this now while I still can. swinging. <laughs> save. Now, this is where I really, really hope, other because if it if it does not render properly here, I'm in a bad way. <laughs> I'm going to have to eat some pizza. In fact, I'm going to do something I haven't done in a long... Well, actually, I'm, I'm not going to do anything different. I'm going to do exactly what always works. You should stick by the plan. That's what we say over here at Johnny Nuts <coughs> Nut Farm. <clears throat> oh, Johnny Nuts. <laughs> when I first bought this land, I said, the best nuts in the world are going to come from here, and they're going to be mine. My nuts. Johnny Nuts. <laughs> oh, Johnny Nuts. <laughs> They'll be world famous. World famous nuts. You see Man, them all over. The guy's you be... a really aggressive nut farm. He's, really <laughs> He's like, it's like, uh, like his his form of advertising is to walk into the bar and be like, I don't hear anyone talking about my nuts. Is there a reason for that? What hey, What's dude, a man got to do? To who get took my the... nuts off the bar? My nuts, Johnny nuts were the bar nuts of everybody's choice. No one had a good night without getting a few nuts in their mouth. Oh, Johnny nuts. Wow. Uh, oh, I can't. I can't. I can't. 
do that. I can do this. <laughs> Chief S. <ass> jerk. <laughs> You know, we have NSFW show coins and clay class. <laughs> That's such an amazing picture. It really is. Well, especially I, the I use, by the way, I am proselytizing S is going down in clay class as something to say, like when something crazy is happening. I say it constantly to people that have no reference to this show. <clears throat> so uh, I thought we were expecting. Feds came in and busted my nuts. <laughs> So he come in with a baseball bat going on this nut farm. Walk up with a baseball bat, start smashing me in the nuts. I look at him, I'm like, "What do you think you are? You think you're gonna hurt me with smashing my nuts?" That's how you would. Before you walk out of here, you're all gonna have my nuts in your mouth, and you're gonna say, <laughs> "Oh, Johnny Nuts, we're sorry. These are delicious." <laughs> Ew, Johnny oh, nuts. Johnny Nuts. I look forward to these conversations when you move over to the West Coast. <laughs> these will be great conversations to have in real life because this is the edited version. That's the fun part about this. This is you guys like pulling Well, the funny thing is with the Jimmy Cox thing, I can't do the actual Jimmy. The, the Jimmy Cox joke is a very simple joke. It's, ew, Jimmy Cox. And then him saying well, something yeah. incredibly vulgar that doesn't have any joke to it. It's just right. him literally describing <laughs> and then, But then shouting life. his name at about it. Be like, like, I'll tell you what about bread and water pitches. I want them to vulgar, 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 vulgar. And then he finishes and goes, ew, ew Jimmy, Jimmy Cox. Cox. This will be it's like fun. Twin Hype Man. Like, Twin Hype Man like, is popular because <laughs> somebody edited it down and everything. Oh, crap. Pants. Hold on. The towel? You can give away the towel? No. Hey, Schwit, can I actually put in two cents right now? Yeah, go. Okay, I actually had a notepad ready to write down all the profanity that would have to be edited out because I've seen Jeremy literally have, like, a full notepad of things that had to be edited out by Tony. Right. I only had four things. Four things? Wait, I didn't even I didn't even count one ex until my brother showed up. <laughs> I was oversensitive because I wasn't sure. Okay. No, I, I think everything like, you know, uh the uh, the A is fine and Okay. D uh, What? Because I had the I had the B U F. <laughs> I got that. B U Oh B but, yeah. Yeah, the A it's in that I wasn't sure if um you were allowed to say bitch so <laughs> oh yeah no 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 um what did you catch when when justin dropped the c word a lot of people missed that oh i missed it flag knock he's very classy the way he sneaks Ooh. it past you what that was just too he oh i understand his sneakiness he's very sneaky that one um okay i want to point out this this sequence of tweets that i just got here this guy says uh i just tweeted out the pizza thing and I was like, watch it three times. He goes, man, I'm not sure about three times. I barely made it through the first time. And then I said, I said, no, try a second time. And he's like, all right, I'll give it another go. And then I said, uh, I said, try showing a friend. And then he was like, I think you're right. Second time I knew what to expect. Third time I could appreciate it. I've shared it with my Facebook friends. Pizza! Um, what the hell? Where did you get that? That came from, I believe, Lucas Brown from Australia. Oh my God! Sent me a a a Twit Hype Man T-shirt, and also, uh, which if you saw the Mother's Day video that I did, I was actually wearing it. <clears throat> the official. Yeah, who made that? I saw that. Document, pretend I'm not here shirt. Lucas Brown from Australia. Those are amazing. Locified. Uh, and he sent them to me, and I'm very uh, I'm very appreciative. And really, the only thing, as Brian holds something that somebody gave him uh, reflectively. No, yeah, well, no, it is. I felt small. I'm like, I'm like I got stuff once, too. <laughs> and, uh, I can't wear these out in public, but I'm very proud. The only... The only problem is that like and as much as i love them they're awesome it's like when i'm in florida i can wear podcast shirts and shirts from things that i'm on because nobody if i'm walking down the street nobody knows me like i'm not gonna hang out with people that know Dude, the podcast go ahead and be that a-hole man go ahead and do that because it's awesome the one time you get busted and it'll be the time you stop no it's not it's not people on the street it's more like if i hang out with ayaz 
And it's not like I'm wearing, like, uh, we, I get it, asshole. You're the twin hype man, like that video you did. <laughs> <laughs> like, you don't need to wear the shirt that says twin hype man on it. I, uh, when, when I first had the, uh, the Wings logo, Brian Brushwood t-shirts made uh, for the tour like seven years ago or so. I was so excited. I, I was wearing them around. And then it stopped the first. All right, I ask. Get myself back. All right. All right. Hello. 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 Let me turn this all the way down. I as just yes. on. Let me get Justin back on. Let me pop everyone back out because I got something to say. Is it in song form? Uh, yes. It sounds like pizza. What happened? What do you think happened? I'm done. I'm declaring all out sustained prolonged war. It's time for a surge. Time Warner Cable, you let them know nonstop that they, every time that those Twitter jerk offs respond, I get one call in the morning, the promise that somebody will look into it and nothing else happens. And, and this, this is, this have is you, have, like, what have like, have you followed up afterward and been like, yo, you never called back well, what are I, you doing i mean how many times do i need to do that i mean i just call i call and then i mean it's like they they're the worst we, uh I crank it to 11 sustain and and don't don't be a-holes about it but say look here's the thing you guys keep saying it's gonna be fixed i have watched personally this guy's internet crap out in the middle of programs for this many days just start up your own dialogue with them and talk to them because here's what they cannot do all they do is they escalate a ticket Someone calls, says, I understand there's a problem. I tell them the whole problem. They say that really ought to be fixed. I say yes. And then they say, let me get back to you. And nobody ever calls back. Maybe they'll send a tech out. The tech walks out and be like, well, I tested it and, you, and it looks good. And, uh, and, and then they walk off. And that's all I've gotten. It has been, what, eight months now? It's been since J July. But now it's like freaking clockwork. It's unreal. David Polanco says, oh, why don't you get business class? Business class only guarantees you that they'll respond the same day. It does not affect the quality of the service. They don't promise anything different about the service, uh, about the actual bandwidth or the consistency or the latency or any of that stuff. I'm serious. And it's, it is, it's at, it's, I mean, it's not the same time every night, but it's always luckily after, do you realize now what I do every time I'm about to go live, I run downstairs, unplug the router, reboot it and pray that it just stays alive for the next 90 minutes. And in this case, it was like two hours. So, Cause this will happen periodically. I mean, I've like having worked at your house, like been on like just random Wi-Fi, Like it will just poop out. And then like come right back on. Yeah, well, and, and here's the thing: it'll poop out, and it takes a while for the for this computer to to realize that it's off. So what I'll do is, as soon as it craps out, I run over, I just I just burp it, I unplug the Ethernet, I plug it back in, and then everything, and then it's like, oh yeah, no, I'm connected. But it's enough to totally derail the show because all the Skypes drop, the chat room goes away. I mean, luckily it did not mess up this episode. You can see we're still encoding right down nice. here. But it's like it, it's it's not. I mean, it's they've replaced the router. And uh, uh, they've they've tested everything. We even I even removed my D-Link router as an access point because the tech was like, I don't know, maybe maybe this, and okay. still still works, still still goes out the same way. Can I can I just and and listen? We can get right back to time water is the worst thing in the world in Thank a second. You. Yes, go. But algebraic eighty nine just came up with the best phrase ever. If you randomly throw somebody that pizza link, like in sneaky style. You just pizza rolled somebody. Oh, you got pizza rolled. Oh. Yes. Well, it was a Totino's ad. Oh. Uh, I will also point out that Algebraic 89 was also the person who said I looked like a young George Clooney. 
Uh, <laughs> boy, oh, so this person's hot. I guess we know who's at the front of Justin's class. Hey, I want to point out that Padre SJ uh, suggested that, you know, since we've had the devil on the show, maybe maybe it's time to have a book an angel on there. So I'll kick that over to John Tilton. We'll definitely have Padre on. That would be awesome. And uh, uh, although I think we're booked for next week, but I think the week after that might be might be open. Do we have Will Harris rain delay? Next week or the week after? It's John knows the schedule. Um, yeah. Uh, John Will Tilton. Be on? Here, just uh, everyone bug John. Harrison was supposed to be on. Harris was supposed to be on, and then uh, we got it delayed was, by by NAB. Yes. No, or, NAB. Uh, NAB. Live yeah. coverage pushed just forward. He's a very tall ginger. He has no soul, so look out for that. <laughs> You know what we need on again is is uh, is V. We need Veronica back on. So. Yeah, we do. Yeah, you know what? Maybe Tom. Maybe look at that. They're gonna call Time Warner. And I tell you what, Time Warner's got a lot of different Twitters too. Let them all know. Let them all know that their service breaks my heart. Um. Oh yeah, we. Yeah, gotta I'm gonna. Have I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and say, hold your breath for Kevin Smith. I don't know if Kevin Smith does. Small time podcast, I guess anymore. Well, well you I, can uh, get a Kevin Smith, not the Kevin Smith. I get, yeah. I can, I can get us Jason Muse tomorrow with one phone call. We could do Muse. We should do. Muse. I think we should have Jason Muse on. Yeah. <clears throat> Tech Candy, call uh, 1-877-552-3374. <laughs> uh, when they say hello, respond with. <laughs> Uh, people are saying I need to get a different provider. I'd love what to. What else, right? If you that was live possible. far out enough in Texas that well, there's a lot of choice. I, I could do AT and T, but the service is worse. It's lower bandwidth, and uh, and the cable and the cable suck. Of course, I'm talking about. Uh, I'm call, uh, talking about uh, cutting the cable anyway, cutting the cord. Yeah, but I mean, you still need like cable, cable, like like internet, right? Yeah. Yeah, people are freaking out when I mentioned AT and T. They're like, "Worst idea ever!" Yeah, DSL. Yeah. You got, you got files in your area? No. Although, like, yeah. uh, like this is eventually this is a Doxis three that they're upgrading to. It'll eventually be fifty megabits down and like um, twenty megabits up or something. But right now, I think it's barely five megabits up. But again, oh. that's that's all fine for this. It's just it's, it's just called, like Verizon LTE when you're doing like this show because the upload speed is what really matters. Yeah. So, all right. Like so real quick, uh, I've had a few people ask during the chat room if, if I'm going to do, cause I've always, whenever anybody's talked about like that are like in South Florida, they're like, Hey man, fucking we should do. Oh God. I cursed on Twitter. Um, I first, sorry. whatever they're like, Hey, let's do like a South Florida meetup. I'm always like, oh, okay, no, we'll do one. And then I never do one. Uh, but, People have asked, like, if I'm going to do one before I leave. I would love to do one. Let me just real quick show of hands who in the next two weeks would come to World of Beer in the world famous World of Beer where me and Brian have drank and had a good time. Uh, in where is it? Probably Coconut Creek. If you guys are down, let me know. Yes, it, that was the pee in a trash can <laughs> night. There it is. Okay, we're back. We got control. Uh, oh, I was gonna, I was gonna uh, give you a pat on the back, Justin, for last week's uh, interpretation of uh, "Kiss by a Rose," "Kiss from a Rose." Oh, the, the the Boodles. Oh my God. No, 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 not the Boodles. The 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 breakdown of the video. Oh yes. Bonnie. No, that was a really that was very funny. I think we did a good job on that one. Yeah. Yeah. Web 3900 says I need a week's notice. Well, I'm giving you a week's notice. What is the, say it'll what, be, what's the major city by Coconut Creek? Uh, uh, I guess what? Uh, Fort Lauderdale Fort is the Lauderdale, closest Lauderdale, city. Yeah. It's, right, it's between Fort Lauderdale and Boca. It's like Lauderdale, north of Miami, but uh, probably 45 minutes to an hour north of Miami. And when would this be? This would be, let me look at the map. And by map, I mean calendar because I'm an idiot. It's like a map of the dates. 
Holy cow. Rabbit Badger just retweeted someone who says that I just realized that booby trap spelled backwards is party boob. Wow. Wow. Huh. Makes you think. What do you say, folks, to the 26th, Friday or Saturday, the 26th? World of Beer, chat realm meetup. In May? Uh, it'll be a fun, hilarious time for everybody. Labor and uh, we can weekend. all that, drink and Memorial high Day? Five. Memorial Day weekend. Memorial Day weekend? Well, I, I mean, it, 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 a bunch of people weekend. come to Florida on Memorial Day weekend. It probably happens every year. Yes. Thank you, John Maloney. I am glad somebody got the Scott Thompson joke. Although I did like an idiot say that he invented the chicken lady. Of course, Mark McKitty invented the chicken lady. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I was watching a basketball game while I wrote that. So uh, there was some geek page about uh, like 15 things you didn't know about Game of Thrones. And uh, one of them was that the guy who plays uh, Jamie effing loves this video. <laughs> like, he just he, like, he turns it on and laughs and loves it. <laughs> Dude, the kid who plays Joffrey, number one, is amazing. He is just so intensely unlikable. Uh, but he has just, uh, the secret to those slapping scenes is he has such a girly little... <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, allegedly, according to that same article, George R. R. Martin's first thing he said to this actor was, you were great. Everyone hates you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's weird. That's what Jason says to me at the end of every episode of TNT. <laughs> <laughs> Which, by the way, I'm back to the pretty much the only time that I don't listen to TNT every day uh, is when I am when I'm on listening to Game of Thrones. And now I'm done listening to Game of Thrones. So I'm back to TNT. And the first episode that I listened to was Brian and Tom making an elaborate reference to Game of Thrones. <laughs> it was like a nice way to ease me back in. I like this. This is awesome. Let me uh, I'm gonna save as another way. I don't usually save it twice, but I'm so nervous about it. I'm going to save it as a WMV as well. Let's see if that does anything. All right. Well, do you want to, uh, I guess it's already 1130. You should probably wrap this up. You got, you got, are you crazy busy getting ready? Uh, me? No, 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 not yet. Although I do, um, I need to get the weird things podcast all wrapped up in a bow so we can get out for everybody tomorrow Man, morning. You know what? I, I know we have a significant amount of crossover. Hey, Alex Albrecht, why don't you shut your filthy mouth? You weren't able to continue our show. <laughs> Way to drop the ball, loser. Why wasn't I written more likable? <laughs> hey, dickweeds, why don't you write in and do a video to win Creepy Santa? Brian, you know what my favorite snack is? Pizza. Oh, oh man. Wait, keep going, keep it going. Hang in there. Stay with me. That was amazing. <laughs> Ow. Hey, so uh, what I was going to suggest. Oh, let me just say, I, I'm assuming. Here's a quick pop quiz for the chat realm. Is there anybody Ow. who doesn't listen to the Weird Things podcast who, who watches this show, watches or listens to it? Because that was an exceptional episode of the Weird Things podcast last night. If you remember, S was going down in clay class. Yeah, no, so S, S some went down in in clay class. Uh, there, it was it was as great as the space elevator debate of 2011, it, or was it 2010? Probably to 2010. Uh, that we we now have the lone man on Mars debate of 2012. FLS Garnage just says the two words Martian Auschwitz, <laughs> <laughs> which was a line that I thought of in the middle of it, and, and I could not help but laugh. I was like laughing to myself, and it was at a very inappropriate time to start laughing, and then I had to say it as soon as it became appropriate. 
Oh, uh, yeah, well, let me just say this. If you like Weird Things, if you like NSFW, you're probably going to like Weird Things. It's a very fun show. So check it out. If you haven't, give it a try. Uh, oh, if you if go to weirdthings.com and take a listen. Um, uh, you can listen to, I'll tell you what, talk, let, let Chat Realm start ma- sending links to their favorite episodes. Because I know you guys, you, you guys, uh, yeah, Weird Things is just NSFW without the pizza. And a little bit of science content. And some not so scientific content. Yeah, there's a lot of horse apples. Yeah, then we got uh, the origin of the rape ape. Man, we got what's it called? There was somebody actually on the Weird Things Twitter, someone who at replied it, and I guess one of those uh, one of those fun little hashtags that goes on on the Twitter, right? Yeah. Um. Katie Brian Jolfso did a little hashtag thing and I guess the hashtag that was going on today was you cute and all but and hers was you cute and all but you don't listen to weird things come wow so bring your bring your pretty ass over to the place where they talk about things other than the weird things podcast uh yeah so here we go we got uh, we got some uh, the last couple Justin was hosting, so that's a little bit weird. Yeah, but they did have Tom Merritt and Scott Sigler, so if you dig those, then yep. uh, that's fun. Oh, you did call it jet lag wear hookers. He he didn't seem down with the title when I suggested it. Oh no, I went with it. <laughs> oh good. <laughs> uh, jet lagged wear hookers was pretty good. Uh, raising Arizona demon killers with those ladies. Why hog? Oh, that just... was a great one. I think that was probably our first weekly one, right? Yeah. No, we were just in the zone, running in. So basically, like, here's the deal: the, the podcast has been around for a while, like Have over you a couple seen years. Something? But... Say, wander through a village, the camera pleading. The... La, 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 la. <laughs> My people are dying, Senator. <laughs> all right. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> all right. So, is that a no on goblins? I, it's got to no, be I trolls. Wanna, I want to. I want to get out further. What did you say? Were you saying gremlins or goblins? You gave me two guesses there. No, I said my, my, this my, is a very good representation of the Weird Things podcast right my now. My initial instinct is gremlins. I think it's goblins. I think we're dealing with right, a goblin fine, infestation an problem. Uh, uh, what, you want? I mean, my it's it's trolls. This thing has got troll, troll right, written troll. all over. None of you. None of you. I noticed none of you said ghosts. Um, no. I guess also. Can I guess meth? Is that is that one <laughs> still free? <laughs> I'd like to. I'd like to amend mine to meth. All right, would you, are you ready? And it's happening in Portland. Like, it's not <laughs> even so far flung part of the world. They refer to Portland. This is what I'm up against. Listeners, I want you to understand. I'm trying to bring everybody's attention to this. This is what I have to deal with, okay? All right, all right, all right. All right, all right we, let's, Justin, let's go you all people, did you know you, in fact, are 200% right? What? Yes! He was goblins that are also referred to as gremlins. Yes! Yes! Anyway. Uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty awesome. Lifestyles of the Reich and famous. Oh my gosh. Uh, wine pairings for cannibal rituals. I don't remember this one. Oh, that Bonnie. was our one with, uh, oh, with yeah. the hump with his hard girls on Valentine's day and, and yeah. the invisible wife. That's right. We had another one with Bonnie In on there. In fact, well. I, I don't think it made it on there, but that was the night that we interviewed. Uh, oh, that's right. Max Landis called. Max Landis, but I don't think that's on the podcast. Well, no, Serial no. Killer Christmas Card was the first time the Andrew's girlfriend voice made an appearance. Oh, really? Which is you... amazing. <laughs> well, let me jump. Oh. And you can help make weird things. It's all like we got fairies and all this stuff, and he like he alters mythology to suit his books. You know? well, should, should just be live in the Brian Brushwood household. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What about what about like yeah. pit bulls? <laughs> Oh no! I I oh no! I see where you're headed here, um, dude. Pitbulls, um, oh, Brian Dunning from Skeptoid just did a thing on Pitbulls, asking like whether or not it was fair that that they totally shit Cape Canaveral. Oh man, I'm so jealous. I would love to be there, and of course Cape Canaveral. Uh, the would go to much like you could you could be able to go and, and finish commercial 3D printers under a thousand dollars. So so like uh, on Amazon basically. 
Yeah, maybe on Amazon or it might be like Square or something. Well, this like is that. when we were yeah, talking about the middleman about the ability to it's, it's, print your own anything, like yeah, completely yeah, distributed you know, manufacturing. You know, why why give them thirty percent or forty percent? When, when did Bonnie do the voice? So I think that we're going to see you know very. That was earlier. That was in like the uh, like the Christmas gift thing. I had some kind of thrill, like for women who feel like the constant victim. Uh, you feel empowered by having these objects. You're like, you know what? I'm more powerful than this because I like Justin's I, Nazi memorabilia collection. Yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I think it was but earlier than this. I, I think it might have been like one of the first thing. things. Okay, Bolds would push all the trolls into the sea. The Jove of Ner German and Norse mythology. Apparently, actually nothing to do that you would find in the Bible, but we just sort of accept. Like, a, you know, we forget about some of them. Mm-hmm. Wow. Well, you would you know, have witch, the witches would be riding all sorts of animals following behind them, and they would go so you know, chase on, people down. On set, in that jaunty song, is all that stuff is happening, the five golden rings, right, right. the turtle doves and whatnot. But the oh, subject no, there's a little after this. I don't know. Outside, you're going to get murdered by Odin. <laughs> so so the, 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 that word, because I, I, I came across a word which I'd never heard before. It was uh, ho hogmany. Okay. Hogmany. Hogmany is an old word for the last day of the year, so you know, New Year's Eve. And so there's different interpretations of what it means. And so uh, once, and again, there's different disagreement on what it's supposed to mean, but they say it's the Scots and, and Gaelic version, not Gaelic, but some other version of that. Variants of the word are to be found. Oh, in the where's Norse the voice? Root, just, Andrew just said, and you disable all YouTube comments. <laughs> and Man, I'm somebody chat room, find a goddamn voice. You're for, 1907 right. now, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Well. Anyway, it's a really good show. It's uh, it's way good. Thrust and Justice. That was a good one. Oh man, that was uh, <laughs> I forgot about Thrust and Justice. As Brian as a new superhero. <laughs> Body rock. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the All Drug Olympics. Oh, that's as far back as it goes for right now. Man, I'll tell you what. Uh, yeah, and then the latest one from last week is Meat Blobs Keep Falling on My Head. And this week, I don't know what it's going to be called, but it's going to be up tonight in a few hours. God damn it. That looks so creepy, I as I swear to God, I'm going to start crying. Well, that's what I'm going for. <laughs> uh, there's a, I think there's King in this version of Vid Blaster now. I should start playing with that. All right. Well, speaking yep. of getting this done, uh, I should probably retire to my cave and, and finish this thing. So thank you to everybody. I, as, as always, you are uh, uh, the best person ever. And I very much look forward for, uh, for us to be friends in the flesh and high five each other on a regular basis. Yes, we will do that. We will make a time to high five. God, it's going to be the best. I'm going to love all of it. Uh, uh yeah, um, uh, let me just real quick give another big thank you to T2, T2, and Cheeto, and Blake. Dude, dude, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say... Yeah. I have to call him on two. Oh no, no, I'm sorry. I can hear you now. Uh, I'm I... trying to do NSF show. N yeah. NSFW show. NSF show. NSF show. NSFW show. NSFW show. There we go. Third time's a charm. No, no, no. no. Yep. Yep. No. yep. No. Oh, that was that was my fault. Sorry about that. <laughs> I heard you. I turned it up, uh, dude. I I I'll tell you what, man. Pure rage. Pure rage. I am serious. Sustained daily tweets. Just, just asking. Hey, man, what's up? You got? Have you guys fixed Brian Brushwood's internet yet? That's all I'm asking for.
By the way, you're really missing something if you're not seeing the visuals on this. <laughs> you got to can you kick it over to the to the feed or is that going out to him? Uh crap. <laughs> it's going out on the feed. Is it, it is? Right? Okay. All right. Mit Connie's Hupen ist Stimmung garantiert, weil bei uns Show und Spaß ganz groß geschrieben wird. Und Connie's Hupen. Get back to the horn honking. Be serious. These guys. That's the scary part. Holy crap. Did somebody find my Time Warner account? That can't be true. Well, when you make it their problem. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the cappuccino is asking, like, did they invent Tejano? What's going on? <laughs> Does that like like close your eyes and picture you're drinking a Corona, and then like tell me tell me if this sounds like Tejano. Ganz groß geschrieben wird und Connie's Hupen. Das weiß doch jedes Kind. Like a bad trip on the Matterhorn. And you just gotta add you just gotta add like a <laughs> in there. <laughs> 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 Picture you're you're doing construction. Cause they <laughs> All right. Uh, all right, look, I, I, we're going to shut it down before I get shut down by the man again. I ask thank you so much a billion times over. You are you are superior to the uh, 1986 Chicago Bulls. What? Well, the 86 Bulls, sure. The 86 Bears, no. The 96 Bulls, no. Yeah. <laughs> but thanks. I actually, what's funny is I was going to say the Bears, but I was like, well, no. Then no, I'm somebody... definitely better than the 86 Bulls. They yeah. sucked. I switched to yeah. the Bills. On you're better than that one yes. game between the Patriots and the Spurs. <laughs> Did you like that? <laughs> I very much liked that. I thought that was hilarious. Uh, all right, everybody. Be -do -beep. So, by Adios. the way, here's what happens right now on the mentions. I'm just going to kick this over here so you guys can follow. The next step that happens every single time is we get a bunch of these, and then the next one will be... Oh, I'm sorry to hear that you have a problem. Direct message us with your contact information, and we'll make it right. And then I go back and forth, spending like five tweets back and forth explaining everything. And then I say, now, the next part is you tell me you'll do something. Someone comes out, and they'll tell me they don't know how it goes. What I need is one person to see this through to the very end. And, they, and then they say, uh, I, I say, I say, don't just, uh, oh, wait, look. Hey, look, Time Warner Cable. We understand you may be having connection issues tonight. Is this the case? Here we go. Yes, as I do every Tuesday night <laughs> during my award-winning podcast. Let's say top 10 super award-winning amazing podcast. During where I totally don't jerk off for show. top dollar. During my live show. I am a very important person. <laughs> the connection goes out. The show goes down. The fans riot. Riot. Every Tuesday. I just peed on the carpet. There you go. You, that. you sent it before you wrote all of it. Well, because... Well, uh, hold on. Filled with... I'll write him a haiku. Um, <clears throat> it, it totally sucks. It totally sucks. Please. Like warm, 
piss from <laughs> no, 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 no. It totally Why? sucks. Listen, I know how to handle these things. <laughs> this. Oh, the... I, I recorded a video of the issue. And then send him the pizza video. No, why can't this be fixed? No, why can't this be fixed? Uh, why can't? Why? No. I just get cheated. <laughs> why there no fix for? All whatever. right, you don't have to actually write. Thank you. Please. Do not. I was trying to play this video and then Don't pizza roll that asshole. Escalate. <laughs> that. Please don't escalate a... unless you mean to perpetrate <laughs> the problem. Um, there you go. Please don't escalate. That's a high school. <laughs> no, they're gonna, not going to take you seriously. That's a high I guess school. they don't take you seriously now. So if you want to know what? Never mind. Yeah. yeah. I think you still think you should pizza rolls. Oh, my. Rage. There you go. It totally... Oh, wait. Oh. We know your deal. I am not rioting. I'm totally rioting, Schwood. I, it totally sucks. Why there no fix forever? Please don't escalate. That's a haiku of my rage. There we go. I <laughs> just feel like, listen, I'm trying to J-O real quick. <laughs> You're really ruining my bone. <laughs> E.T. need to bone home, know what I'm saying? I mean, like, it's just me and my friend. Hey, man, it's me, Johnny Nuts. If you want to know what nuts should taste like, get mine in your, in your mouth. I got all sorts. I got pecans. My name's Johnny. Hey, Johnny Nuts is what you're going to say when you eat them. You're, you're, they're going to roll around in your mouth, and you're going to go, Oh, Johnny Nuts, these are delicious. Oh, my God. Okay, I said goodbye five times, and this time I'm actually going. I kisses on your face. Bye. He's gone. He's gone. Mm. Oh, look. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Oh, shit. I just got pizza rolled by the real horse boy. <laughs> I look over and I see video of Schwinn's cable issues and I think, oh, hells yeah. That means somebody caught it on tape so I can point, send it to him and that'll fix it. And then I clicked on it and it was definitely uh... pizza. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> Are we shutting this down? I we I we it's time to go. We gotta finish this. <laughs> yeah, so I was like, okay, how can I counteract this? <laughs> nope, that's good. That's good. We're done. We're out. We're out of here. <laughs> okay. So long, party right, people. I have to yell at my ex fiance to help me with all the jerrigging of the audio and video. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's time. To all right, go look, you're gonna have to play so that song because I'm hanging up on you right now. Bye, guys. Crap, here, they're posted in the chat room. There, right there. And it breaks my heart because I just can't bear to be I guess I could, I guess I could stick Brian around. That seems weird. Of NSFW. Oh, I'd rather I think I got it. die in a fire. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Then yeah, spend buddy. spend a single moment without Brian Brushwood. Oh, I'd rather be dipped in honey and fed to a big ant pile yes. than do without Justin Robbins. What are you playing this to? A little while. Um, hold on. Oh, NSFW. I well, I guess you. I guess that's it. Now I'm out. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Burr, 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 burr. Oh, NSFW, <laughs> I love you.
Oh, man, I'm still live, aren't I? I'm sorry, guys. I forgot that uh, it reestablished. Man, I'm glad I didn't start jerking off or something. I'd be like, oh, it's the best fucking episode ever. <laughs> you want to see? What's funny is as I'm doing this, I was just thinking. <laughs> I was just thinking that um, I wish I could share my conversation with you. Here's what I, here's what I said. <clears throat> I said, uh, you know, they're all like, uh, unfortunately, escalating the issues. The local sport is the only option we have considering the crying nature of the issue. And then I said, is there any way to assign one person to see us through being handed off is the problem? I said the first time it, this is the first time it happened on the show. And I gave him a link to <clears throat> uh, to the BB live show entry. Um, and then I said, the fans made this silly declaration of war. And they're like, I'm sorry, we don't have the ability to correct the issue here. So the only response is to relay a local sport. I said, I understand. It's just important that I impress upon you the increasing severity of the reactions I'm seeing. Each time I get kicked off, the crowd gets rowdier. It's getting to be a game for them, and I don't want to be a PR nightmare for you guys, which is your clue to know how to react each time it happens. See? I'm trying to be the nice guy. I'm all like, oh, man, look, guys, I think you're great. I think your service is great. I love all my channels. I love my fast internet with value. You guys are, it's just, it's just this, these fans. I mean, they're very, 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 very dedicated. And they're very tenacious. And they really don't like when my internet goes out. But that's, uh, but then, you know, but I, I mean, man, if it's, I mean, I'm just, you know. It's no, it's no big deal. I mean, they, they declared a war. I mean, <laughs> who declares a war, right? I mean, it's just the internet, right? Seriously. I really, really think that the best way to keep them from getting out of hand would be if you could have someone come and fix my internet. Just just a thought. And maybe, maybe that's just me talking, right? You know, I'm just saying. Just saying. Just saying. Fucking cut your throat. Oh my gosh, there's a spider on the table. Well, there's a spider on the table. Kill it. Sorry, kill it, Darren. Kill it. <laughs> <laughs> D, D, 